Welcome everyone to the Cat's Meowth and a pack battle. It's been a long time since we have done any pack battles, probably since season two of Major League Pack Battles. And we were sent eight generations packs from Pokegal, a fantastic Poketuber. And so I thought it was only fair to share some of the love and make these packs into a series of pack battles rather than just a standard pack opening. So so to kick off the pack battles, we will be going up against Doctor Who Riffs, who also happens to be my very good friend Liz. And uh, I don't know, we'll just open up uh, Blastoise because I love Blastoise. And oh, Charizard or Venusaur. Oh, we should go with Charizard. Okay. So pack battle point breakdown is going to be the same as uh, Major uh, Major League pack, pack, uh, if I could sp speak right. <laughs> it's going to be the same as Major League pack battles. Uh, rare reverses are worth one. Hollows are two. Breaks are three. Full arts are four. Secret rares are five. And I completely forgot to do a bonus pick for uh, this round or this battle. Um, I think we've arranged two other pack battles uh, with two other Poketubers and we're working on bonus picks for them. I do still need one more volunteer, although by the time this video goes up, hopefully I will have that uh, volunteer nailed down and we will have a good long weekend of pack battles. Um, but just in case I don't, uh, go ahead and advertise that right now so that we can hopefully get someone on board within the next few days. Uh, basically what we did is since these aren't sealed in a mythical collection box, um, we're just doing two packs and uh, my opponents will pretty much just be picking up a mythical collection box. Although I believe Liz, uh, Doctor Who Riffs, was unable to find a mythical collection box and ended up picking out a uh, the Charizard box and just uh, grabbing two packs from that. And she, well, how, how did she put it? I think, uh, oh, that her pulls were ridiculous. Um, I don't know if that's ridiculously awesome or um, what, what that is, so uh, we'll see. So I think, uh, I should have looked it up before. Instead of one, two, three, one, two, I think it's, uh, oh, shoot, I forgot what it is. Is it one? I'm trying to, like, remember the Radiant Collection card. So we're going to go one, two, three, one, two, three, and see where that ends up. If I mess it up, I am so sorry. Okay, so again, no bonus pick for this round, but uh, that's okay. Uh, let's just hope we get something good. Oh, I should have had my Generations once list up, but I completely forgot about that, too. Slowpoke. Tangela. Rhyhorn. Ha! I actually needed a Psychic Energy. I think I need, like, two more to complete uh, play sets for decks. Swablu. Haunter. And a Max Revive. So, looks like I did that right. Uh, this should be my Radiant Collection card. Oh, sorry, my reverse, uh, which is even better, a reverse fire energy, and, oh, I do have it open another tab. Oh, so I do have the fire energy. I am looking for a reverse dark and a reverse fairy. Uh, regardless, though, this is a really awesome pull, even though it's not worth any points. Uh, so this is, I think, my Radiant Collection card. And it's a Sylveon. So we have an EX. Uh, we are on the board, I believe, with three points. Um, yeah, EXs and breaks off. No breaks in generations. Um, but yes, we have a one Sylveon. Let's go ahead and sleeve this beauty up. All right. And, um, so that's my Radiant Collection card, so this is my Generations Rare. And it's a Riot Shoe Hollow! It's awesome! So that's another two points, so we are up to five points. I hope when she said ridiculous, that's a ridiculously awesome, um, so we are already at five points in the first pack. All right, so uh, we did get that right. One, two, three. One, two, three. And let's see what our commons and uncommons are. Krabby. Machop. Hey, Grass Energy. Geodude. Charmander. Esper. And a Chikorita. My reverse. 
It is a Raichu. So that is a reverse rare. We get one more point. And I'm actually a little saddened by this. Uh, this was on my once list up until last... Uh, last week, I believe, when I received a trade. Um, I'm actually trying to... Try to remember when I did the video, but um, this trade came in like less than a week ago. So that would have been a really amazing pull if I hadn't traded for it. But still, double Raichu pulls. Uh, sorry, Raichu. I always put the extra syllable in there. I'm very sorry. People get on me all the time. I know it's Raichu. My Radiant Collection card is an Altaria. Um, you know, I didn't think about this. Ten. I mean, it's... Oh, I should have... I don't know if I... Uh, ooh. This really shouldn't count as a hollow, so I'm not going to count points for this. But this is probably something I should have clarified um, beforehand. Hmm. Uh, well, I mean, I think you, there. I don't know. I feel like you shouldn't call that a hollow. I mean, this should be your your hollow. Um, you know, it's one thing for you know full art, or, you know, full art Pikachu, even though it's not a non EX would still be a full art. Um, but that shouldn't count as a hollow. And my rare is a Mega Charizard. So I, according to some of my viewers, I had some pretty rotten luck when I opened up my 36 count uh, pack or 36 booster pack opening of generations. I didn't quite hit a 50% ultra pull or ultra rare pull rate. Uh, but it seems like ever since then, my mythical collection boxes have been beautiful. Uh, the last one I opened up, I pulled a Charizard and a Mega Charizard from it. And here we go with another Mega Charizard. So um, that's another three points. So uh, we've got six points for our EXs and another three points for the Raichu. Raichu, sorry. Nine points total. So uh, my end has been a fantastic battle. I hope Doctor Who's Riffs uh, were, uh, had some ridiculously awesome uh, oh, uh, pulls as well. Uh, her channel link will be in the description below, and I will get her opening link up as soon as I as as I can. I definitely hope everyone will go check her out. Um, she hasn't been too active in the Pokemon scene lately. Uh, there was another channel I know she was collaborating on with a few other people that had a bunch of cool stuff on it as well. Uh, but this is her main channel, and what's really cool is that there's a TCBM on there from like five years ago when we pretty much first met, and uh, we've been friends ever since. So. Uh, thank you very much, Liz, Doctor Who Riffs, for this amazing pack battle. Um, I hope you got some great pulls. I am so excited for mine and kicking myself that that Raichu is, wasn't one that was uh, that should have been on my list if I hadn't traded for it. But um, what, what were the chances, uh, especially pulling a double Raichu? So I'm just happy to have some extra playable cards. Um, you know, Raichu is really nice with a circle circuit for just that DCE and then adding two more E. EXs to the binder. So awesome pulls and hopefully the rest of our pack battles will go just as nicely.